Happy retirement, Kathy. I dressed for the occasion. I trust you're also wearing a Christmas sweater. Seems fitting that your retirement comes at the most fashionable time of year. I will miss you around the office. You have always been a dependable part of the team and always brought an unexpected uh, element to the office. We could count on you to do your work and also always surprise us with a funny comment or reaction. I hope your retirement brings you lots of time with your family and your friends and congratulations. Happy retirement. Hope all goes well for you in the future. Glad to work with you. It's been a pleasure and you'll be missed. Thanks, Kathy. Take care. Hey, Miss Kathy. The countdown to retirement is over. I'm pretty sure you've been doing that since the day that I started a little over three years ago. Um, know that you're going to be missed. Appreciate it coming in and uh, being able to razz you a little bit but I do appreciate everything that you have done to make my job a lot easier. And uh, my kids are gonna miss you. Uh, little Brooke's gonna miss seeing you when she comes in to, when it's uh, bring your kid to work day. So I hope that you enjoy retirement and know that you're gonna be missed. Appreciate you. Kathy, congratulations on your retirement. Thank you for all that you have done for everyone. The office won't be the same without you. I hope soon you are able to go on all the trips that you have planned and I hope you're able to do it without all the restrictions we've had this last year. I hope that you have the best retirement ever. Hi Kathy, I just wanted to say I hope you have the best retirement. I really appreciate all the help that you've done in the office with me over the past couple years. I know you have had a countdown going since well before I was with Sequoia Pacific, um, but I hope that retirement brings you lots of time with grandkids and Disneyland and all the traveling that you want to do. So thanks again for being um, such a great help, and I know that Sequoia Pacific will miss you. Hey, Kathy, congratulations on your retirement. Just uh, taking a minute to say uh, it's been uh, very fun and interesting working with you all these years. We've had some laughs, that's for sure. And uh, fun talking about our kids as they grew up playing ball. Always, always fun to talk about that. And I just want to wish you well. And I know you're going to have a good time. I won't worry about that. Uh, I'm uh, somewhat jealous and hope to join you in the retirement ranks soon. But uh, have fun and be safe. Congratulations, Kathy, on your retirement. You'll be missed, but never forgotten. Enjoy your time with your family and friends. Take care. So, Kathy, this is it. Um, your last days at Sequoia Pacific Builders. Uh, it's been a, an adventure, to say the least. Um, I appreciate uh, all that you have done uh, with the company and for me, um, your dedication to helping out when I'm a little lost in the office. Uh, when I came into the office, you helped out a lot and I appreciate that. I hope that you have uh, fun travels and that you uh, are healthy enough to hit Disneyland and Disney World as many times as possible. Um, take care um, and have a, uh, a great retirement. Uh, my heart goes out with you to have uh, everything within your retirement uh, be joyful. He always enjoyed coming into the office, seeing you, and you always treated him as, as a special show dog, as you call him. He got his hair cut for Christmas just for the video. So he's clean and ready to go. So Kipper says, Merry Christmas and good luck. Now, from my standpoint, one of the things I remember most about Kathy, and it rings true every year, was her annual trip she and her girlfriends would take to San Francisco for Christmas shopping. 
I was always a little bit jealous because I did enjoy the San Francisco in Chris, at Christmas time because of the beauty of the lights and the, what it looked like. It's just a great feeling to be in the, in the city at Christmas time. Kathy was always very proud of her daughter, both daughters, but I know she enjoyed going to softball games as she watched her daughter play softball in Oregon. It was a long trip, but she did it routinely on the weekends to watch her daughter play. Kathy has always had the best interests of Sequoia Pacific at heart. Sometimes it was a little difficult to get through, but she always believed what was best for Sequoia Pacific because it was her responsibility. She looked out and made sure we had all the certificates of insurance in place. Everything was done and I never found a file that wasn't well organized, well documented, and stood up to any auditor, any auditor's review. A person like that is hard to replace and hard to find. So I don't know how easy it's gonna to be to replace her. I know it won't be easy because of her dedication and her willingness to do what was right all the time. Kathy was always concerned about others. May not have always seen it, but I know since I left Sequoia Pacific some nine years ago, there was never a day that I wouldn't show up, that she wouldn't ask me how Tanner was doing or how Kipper was doing. Didn't matter what I was doing, but she always, or Melanie, but it was always about Kipper and Tanner. And it made me feel good as a person and as a father. Kathy, you'll be missed. Your dedication was always admirable. Thanks for the years. Good luck. Kathy, you've been one of the common denominators in my life over the last 20 years. We have worked together and our kids have played together through the majority of these years. Although you and I have had our run-ins, it has been greatly offset by all the hard work and attention to detail we have all come to know from you. I wish you all of the best in these golden years of retirement. Have fun.